everyone, so I'm back. I just did a vlog video. If you like a sit down, get to know me sort of vlog video. If you want to see that, check the link out below. Um, so today I'm doing a, a thrift haul, obviously, by the title, which I'm sure you guys looked at, which is why you clicked this video in the first place. So, thrift haul. I got everything from Salvation Army and two trips last Saturday and today, which is Friday, so about almost like a week apart, like seven, no, six days apart, I went to a thrift store and I don't want to show you guys. I got some really great things. As mentioned before in my vlog, I got a new job and I've been trying to, when I thrift now, I thrift a little different. I try to get stuff that I feel like I can wear in that retail setting. Stuff that I can mix with their stuff and kind of give it my own spin and my personal style. That sort of thing. So, let's get started. I'll start with a few items that I have hanging right here that are actually clean and then I will go into my bag, my bags, and show you. Um, so, anyways. I got this shirt, which is just a long sleeve, basic striped shirt. I mainly got it because of the like greenish yellow. It kind of complements my the blue in my hair. I don't know. I feel like yellow looks good on me now just because I have blue in my hair. Although obviously my hair is not going to always be blue. But for the moment. And it was a dollar shirt. I got this long sleeve shirt. I figured I could wear it with like overalls or something. And this is a dollar and it's from the Gap. Next I got this shirt for a dollar. And this is also, this no, this isn't from the Gap. This is Old Navy. And it's just a tight fitting um, racer back sort of almost crop top but not quite sort of thing it's um olive green and it has like cream cream color in it and i thought it was cool and i feel like when i wear it it'll kind of almost look like i have a halter top on without it being a halter there is a bra sort of thing built inside although i will still wear some type of bra because i can't be out here without no bra i don't do that but anyways got that for a dollar and i thought it was nice it's a really nice thick material it's almost too late of this it's almost out of season, but we're still having really nice warm days like today. Hence why I have one no sleeves. Um, we have warm days like today and then I can wear them then. And I thought it'd be nice with like some destroyed jeans or some mom jeans or something like that. Next up I got is because I um, I'm on this I wanna say plaid kick because obviously I'm not buying a lot of plaid because you'll see in this haul this is the only plaid item. But every time I go to a thrift store, I'm always looking in their flannel slash plaid section to see what I can find. This one was a little bit more pricey for me personally because I don't like spending a lot at the thrift store. But for the brand, it was worth it. It was $6.99. It's a Ralph Lauren, um, it's a Ralph Lauren um, plaid button up. It is a size medium and I typically wear a small, extra small in like women brands. And But it's fine, cuffed up. I mean, with the sleeves cuffed up, and I'm gonna tuck it into a skirt. And just to show you the skirt, I'm gonna tuck it into this skirt, which isn't thrifted, but I got this from American Eagle. But I was gonna tuck it into this little full leather skirt, roll the sleeves up, um, wear some black tights, and I thought that'd been a really nice fall outfit. So that's why I got this. And I got this, I thought of that skirt when I got this, because I thought it was perfect. I love the color, it has a little Ralph Lauren. Um, monogram right there so I got that next we'll go into the bags of stuff that I have so I have a small bag and I actually lied I got this one on Wednesday because I was riding by a Salvation Army I went in there and I only got two things because I only had um close the door I'm doing a video being interrupted you close the door all the way Sorry about that. I need a sign on the back of my door that says, filming, don't enter. But anyways, so I went in there. I only got two things. So the first thing I got, I got strictly for the color. I've been wanting something this color, and I'm... It's the season for sweaters. I typically buy most of my sweaters from Salvation Army because they're cheap, and I'm not spending like 20, 30 bucks for a sweater. And yeah, I have a lot of sweaters, so if I buy, pay a few dollars for them, 
it's cool because I'm probably going to wear it like once or twice off the season. Well, this is a sweater that I just fell in love with and I wore it to death, which has happened. So I got this. I think this is actually from the military or something. And I say that just because of like the, the stuff in the inside. My military pants have the same writing. So I'm guessing it's someone like if you're in the army or something, they sell this. anyways it's a nice dark hunter green um sweater and it has like these arm patches which is cool i mainly like the color it has these on the shoulders i'm not really a fan of i'm thinking about somehow getting rid of that portion of it but that's just how it looks i haven't tried it on yet it is 100 percent wool i hate wool it's very uncomfortable but i figure if i layer a long sleeve under it like a simple t-shirt sort of thing um will be fine. And I got this for $3.99. The next one I got ugh, was pricey, but then I realized that this color was half off at um, Salvation Army, which is the only reason why I got it. But I did like the way it fit, and it is this sort of blazer um, cardigan sort of thing. It has a belt in the back, which you could tie in the front or tie in the back. I'm not really a fan of belts, but when I tied it, it looked really nice. And I figured I could wear it to work with a pair of jeans or something. And this was, it's by BCBG. Um, and it is a size medium, but it fits me fine. I really feel like last time I got the, at the thrift store, people have shrunk or something, like pre-shrunk themselves. And I look at it that way. I'm buying pre-shrunk clothes and it fits me. So, hey, I care less about the size. It was originally $12.99. I feel like... Thrift stores sometimes kind of rip you off with like the good brands, so like, not necessarily rip you off, because you're still getting a good deal, but I'm cheap. But they'll like mark that, the the good brands up. Like I've seen this really awesome bag, I don't even remember the, the brand, but they wanted $25 for it. But it wasn't a brand I knew, so I didn't really like want to pay that much. Anyways, I'm getting into a tangent. I got this for $6, because it was half off. And I like the, like the nice grayish slash oatmeal color. So I got that. I got this really bright yellow sweater, and this is actually by J. Crew, and I got this for a dollar this week when I went. I haven't cleaned it yet because it says dry cleaned. I hate when I buy stuff from that has to be dry cleaned. That's an extra step. But I got a car now, so I guess I can go to dry cleaners and drop this stuff off. <sighs> That's why I don't like spending a lot at the Salvation Army. But anyways, again, yellow goes good with my blue hair. I like it. It's um, nice and bright. It is like cable knit sort of. So I got that for a dollar. Hmm. I got this for my daughter, but it's in my bag because I have to um, dry clean it. It's by J. Cree as, as well. And it's just a gray sweater. And I got this for, I took the tag off. I want to say like three, four bucks. Probably three dollars because I don't really spend a lot on her stuff at the thrift store because I typically buy all her clothes new. I just do. Not mine. My kids. But it was J. Crow, so I bought it. If I buy her something from a thrift store, it's usually something really awesome that I feel like I can't part with, which is usually like a jacket or something. Speaking of which, I got her this jacket today. And it's actually by Brawl 66. But I got it for $2. And it's amazing. It's a green army color jacket. So I like it. And it has rouging in the middle portion of it. And she'll love it. It looks like something I'll wear, which is what she likes. So she likes to dress like mommy. So I got that for her. I got this sweater. It is really funky. The color is not funky, but the whole style and the fit of it and the detailing in it is funky. It is a cream sweater. It looks like crop sort of. Let me get up close so I can show you because there's like detail in here you can't see because of the color. So it has like these, like these rib sleeves. At the bottom is kind of like a sweatshirt material. And then it's just plain like sweatshirt material. Then they have like this cable knit right here. And anyways, it's like a really blousy sort of um, sweatshirt slash sweater. I thought it was so cool though. I didn't try anything on today when I went because I had on all these. I didn't dress for thrifting. I typically, if I go thrifting, I wear like leggings, a cami, then I'll throw some over the cami. I wear the cami so I can take whatever I have on off and I can try stuff like this on. Without having to go in the fitting room because I try my stuff out on the floor 
because I'm just that person. And plus they only allow you to take so many in the fitting room. And I'm always scared someone's going to see my goodies in my basket and take them. And I'm going to come out and be pissed that you got my good items. Like today I found good stuff and I was literally stalking my, my cart. Like, don't touch it. But anyways, I got this for $3.99. It's by the brand Golden Express. I don't know what that is. It might be like an actual vintage item. Let's see. It says no. Made in Tijuana. So no, it's not. But anyways, I got that. I got this shirt. I love the color because it looks nice with my hair. It's not quite yellow. It's like... My posture's bad. It's not quite yellow, but it's like a lime green. So it's just a button-up shirt. It's um, a chiffon material. And it's nice and bright. See? Right? You see? It's beautiful. It's from the Gap. It's my size. It's extra small. And the icing on the cake is... It's brand freaking new. So yeah, we got that. I thought that was cute. Cute, cute, cute. Um, $3.99 for a brand new shirt. Can't beat that. It was on sale at the Gap for $11.99. Thanks for the person who bought this and decided they didn't want it and donated it. Like, I appreciate it. Good calls. I got this Forever 21. Sort of. I mean, it is not sort of. It is Forever 21. But, um, cardigan. One of those open ones. I think they sold this last year because I kind of remember it. Like, seeing it and not getting it. I got it for $4.99. I didn't want to pay $4.99 because I gave Forever 21 and I feel like I get great brands for the same price at Salvation Army. But I really like the way it fit. I just like the way it fit. Like it's nice and blousy and I don't have one this color. So got that. I'm just throwing stuff on the floor because I gotta wash it. So I bought all my stuff today. And I took my mom with me today. So I bought, paid for my stuff. She paid for her stuff. The line was freaking huge. I don't know what the heck was going on. This thrift store is never packed. It was packed. Like, the line was long. And then I seen the skirt right after, like, hanging on a hanger. Because I guess somebody was at the cash register and decided they didn't want it. And, like, took it and, like, hung it on the register, sort of. So I thought I paid for my stuff, but she paid for hers. The next person was getting taken care of. I seen this maxi skirt and I love maxi skirts especially when I can find one at like a freaking solid color so it's a pretty taupe long maxi skirt the line was long I'm like I don't want to spend I don't want to stand in line I don't know if it's like how much is it that was like a dollar it was freaking 99 cents she was like let's get in line so I got in line and they rocked me up a dollar and six cents all together for this I just realized they charged me 106 and tax is six cents and this was 99 cents so I should have paid 105. I got ripped off a penny at Salvation Army. Anyways, I like this. This will be nice with like scrap it tea sort of thing. If I had time I'd wash it now where it's my dad's for dinner, but I got like two hours and my dryer acts shady. So anyway, I have I'm saving like them like my favorite find over here and I'll show you at the last minute. Oh, I got this sweater for my daughter. It it was $1.99. It was cute, that'd be cute with like some black skinnies. Hmm, be cute. I feel like I've been buying her a lot of gray lately. I'm rubbing my style off on her and buying her bland colors. I gotta stop and start buying like one color shoes kit. But I got a cup, cause like, Lord knows, I need another cup. No, I don't. I buy cups forever. And I'm actually staying at my mom's house right now, and I will plan on moving in January. I like when I move, I'm gonna have so many stupid cups because I keep buying cups. But I get this one. It says Campbell's Condensed Tomato Soup. And it's small. It's so cute. Like I could drink my coffee in the morning when I want like a little bit. It's like the same size as my um my Morton Salt mugs that I got. It said like two for 99 cents. I got it for 50 cents. I couldn't find the other one. I wish I could have because I would have loved to have gotten two. So I got this. It has shoulder pads. I'm going to take it out. But I really love blazers or stuff I can wear as blazers. This thing is so freaking funky. I'm like, I don't know. 
like hobo like but look at it like look at the collar look at the print there's this nice button right here amazing so I'm thinking of like layering this some type of way maybe wear some boyfriend jeans and like a tank or cami underneath I don't know something really simple and easy to just throw this on this would be great for lunch or dinner yeah I didn't need something like that oh I need to tell you the price. I know it was really cheap though. So let's see how much it was. It was $2.99. So the last item that I got. Oops. Um. The last item that I got. Every time I go to the thrift store, I look in a particular area for this item. Just because I'm like, hey, one day someone's going to get tired of theirs and throw it out. And I'm going to get it. And I'm not going to have to spend like $200 on one. So I go to this section Every time I go to the thrift store, never find one. I have go to kids section hoping like maybe I'll find my daughter one and hey, one of us has one. Because it's not something I spend a lot of money on. It's not even something I wear a lot, but it's great for when I go get take my daughter to school. I don't know what that was. I feel like I go take my daughter to school and I throw something on, It'd be nice and warm. I'm driving a car now. I don't need like a really big giant winter coat. These are things that are going to keep me warm to get to the car and when I'm out of the car walking into my destination. So guess what I found? I found this in the sweater section. Not the fleece section, mind you. Fucking... Ooh, I like really cursing. A freaking North Face jacket. And it's purple. Not pink. I hate pink. If it was pink, I would not have gotten it. Well, I might have gotten it and gave it to my little sister. But it's dark purple. It's so cute. And I need color in my life. And it's fucking freaking North Face. $8.99. I don't like spending $10 at the thrift store. Well, this, I was like, oh. I would have spent $15 for it. It's um, it's not a full zip down. It just zips down to there. It feels very warm. I can't wait to wash it. I can't wait to show my sister, Brianna, like, hey, you want one last Christmas? I got one for nine dollars at the thrift store, so I'm excited. Like I said, I wouldn't spend as much money as these retail for, because I'm not gonna quit a lot of wear out of it. It's something I'm just gonna wear to hop in my car, to drop, get to where I'm going, hop out of my car, and once I get there, I'm taking it off. There's no point for me to spend a bunch of money on it. And I knew patience has prevailed, because I was waiting and I got one for nine bucks. Get at me. Oh, I thought I wanted to show you that last, and I just thought of one more thing. One more thing, not two. One more thing that I got last week. And I actually spent $12 on this, and I'm cheap. But it is a, I want to say vintage, it's a guess. Um, it'll say yes right there. It's a guess jacket. And it's cool. It's like freaking cool. I tried it on, and I was like, that's cool. And then I was like, and she was like, you gotta get it. You would really think I had a bajillion cups of coffee because I'm in such a freaking good mood today. So I don't feel video sometimes. Sometimes I'm just not in the mood and I feel like you're gonna feel that I'm not. But today, I feel like I'm gonna feel a bajillion videos. So the sleeves are short, mind you. The sleeves are short, but. There's these things here, and you can do this, you can cuff your sleeves. It smells really good, I just laundered it, I just washed it, so yeah, so you do that, and then do this one, and then whatever. Anyways, this is how it looks, good fit, you know, I'm gonna throw it on, I might wear this today. Of the house. Like, I'll just chill it in like a jacket. Old school, you know how I do. Alright, let me go because I know this video is hella long and you guys are probably sick of me talking. But I'll see you guys next time. Bye! I'm like Spider Man. Is that what Spider Man does? He does.